Every kid is unique. At least that's what their parents think. But some kids are more unique than others. Today, we'll be looking at five most unusual kids in the world. Be sure to stick around until the end of the video, because our number one entry will give you all the feels. Number five, Virsavia Borun Gonkarova. I don't go to this school and I don't learn ballet, but I'm trying to do it at home. This 10-year-old Russian girl with a rather unusual name may seem like an ordinary girl. Virsavia is fascinated by ponies and dolphins. She likes to draw, sing, and dance. Her favorite singer is Beyonce. At first glance, she is no different than other girls her age. There is, however, one thing that sets Virsavia apart from all the others. She was born with her heart and intestines outside her chest and abdomen. You see, Virsavia suffers from thoracoabdominal syndrome, better known as the pentology of Cantrell an extremely rare condition that affects one in a million births. When Virsavia's mother Dari was pregnant, doctors told her that her child would never survive. But boy, were they wrong. Turns out Virsavia is quite the little warrior, as she never lets the disease bring her down. She needs to be careful, though, especially when dressing, and her clothes must be so soft as to not damage her heart. Virsavia can't spend whole life with her heart out, though. She needs to undergo a complicated operation that will put her heart back in its place. Number 4. Tessa Evans We we get my hair back, we bet, so it doesn't get to my face. This six-year-old girl from Northern Ireland likes to play outside and is a very active kid. There is, however, something special about her. You see, Tessa suffers from an extremely rare condition called congenital arherenia meaning that she has a bump where her nose should be. Her parents found out about Tessa's condition during an ultrasound scan that showed an abnormally flat face. They were shocked at first, but the condition didn't scare them off. Despite the fact that Tessa has no sense of smell whatsoever, or paranasal sinuses for that matter, she is able to sneeze, cough, and even catch a cold. Tessa also has heart and eye problems. At just 11 weeks, she underwent cataract surgery in her left eye. Unfortunately, complications left her completely blind in one eye. She also underwent a tracheotomy to allow her to breathe while eating and sleeping. Despite her problems, Tessa is a very cheerful child. She doesn't let her condition bother her and is described as such a little character by her mother. Tessa will have to undergo several operations to fit a nose implant which will be replaced by a bigger one when necessary. Number 3. Isaiah Bird Yeah, I have, I have no legs. But I don't need no legs. I'm a wrestler. I'm a gladiator. When it comes to exercising, people have all sorts of excuses. I'm tired. The weather is bad. My shoulder hurts. I'll start on Monday. Unlike most people, Isaiah Bird, the 11-year-old from Long Island, never skips training even though he does have a good excuse. You see, Isaiah is born without legs, but his condition doesn't prevent the boy from training and playing sports. He surfs, swims, skateboards, plays football, but he is particularly good at wrestling. The question is, how does he do it? As Isaiah himself says, he just keeps on training no matter what without excuses. The boy has quite a bit of support, including his mother, Bernadette Hopton, his friends and teammates, and most importantly, his coach Miguel Rodriguez, who started coaching him at a very young age when he was just in kindergarten. Rodriguez said he receives calls, emails, and videos on a daily basis from adults and children alike, telling him that they were inspired by Isaiah's example, his resilience, and his will to win. Number 2. Lalit Patadar <laughs> This 13-year-old boy from India suffers from congenital hypertrichosis, an extremely rare condition, also known as the werewolf syndrome. Yes, you heard that right. Because of this disease, Lalit's body and face are completely covered in hair. The boy's family have sought help, but found no success, as there is no known cure for the condition, at least for now. As you can imagine, the boy had to deal with a lot of bullies who would often call him a monkey and threw stones at him. 
but Lalit's family always came to the rescue. Lalit has gotten used to his strange appearance and now feels comfortable in his own skin. He even became quite popular at school. Strangers, however, have a rather unfriendly reaction when they see him, but Lalit doesn't pay attention to it. Of course, he still dreams of having surgery that would remove the extra hair. He also dreams of becoming a policeman when he grows up. Number 1. Tio Satrio 14-year-old Tio Satrio from Indonesia may have been born without arms and legs, but that doesn't stop him from playing PlayStation and beat opponents. He plays every spare moment he can, using his chin to operate the control pad. Tio attends the local special needs school in Panawangan. Each morning he is picked up by motorbike and taken to the school where he excels at math and religious studies. Holding a pen in his mouth, the boy is able to keep up with his fellow classmates. At first, going to school was tough for Tio because he was self-conscious about his condition. Things quickly improved, though. Thanks to his upbeat nature and infectious laugh, Tio is now a class favorite with fellow pupils and teachers alike. Tio's parents, Mimi and Wawan, take pride in the boy's performance at school. The strange thing is that the parents weren't told of the boy's condition even after his birth. When Mimi and Wawan first learned that their child doesn't have arms and legs, they were shocked, but they quickly adjusted to the situation. It's this acceptance that has turned Tio into a happy kid. Which one of these amazing kids have inspired you the most? Let us know in the comments below.